Luca Matson plays it to the right and wheels into the center. Bryce Miranda, Luca Matson in the right place at the right time. Just to kick off, uh, Luca, th your thoughts on the season so far and how your team is doing? Uh, I think the season is going great, uh, and uh, if you check the table, uh, you can see that. And what reason do you think this is? What is the reason for it that the team is doing so well? Mm. Well, since the day I came and joined the team, uh, all the guys uh, took me uh, as a brother from the day one. Uh, we had a very tough pre-season. Uh, we, we really trained hard. Uh, it ju everything just clicked. So I think yeah, this is the reason. And so before coming to uh, India, what expectations did you have? And, yeah. uh, well, I came here, uh, uh, even before I came here, uh, I said to my mom and dad uh, before I went to, to, the, uh, to India that uh, when, when I come back, uh, I will come back as a, as a champion and as a uh, top goal scorer. So, so far is going great. Uh, I hope uh, we'll be champions. Uh, you took the lead in the race for the top, uh, top scorer after scoring twice against Kokulam. So, what are your thoughts on that? Becoming the yeah, I'm, I'm very happy. Um, as a striker, my, my goal is to score goals and help the team. So, more goals I have, more, more I help the team. Uh, but I would say that um, I put team team success before my personal success. So I would rather we are champions. Uh, of course, I will be very happy if I will be top scorer. Okay, and we see the your understanding and chemistry with Zuniga. Of course, both of you have scored a lot of goals. So what is the secret behind that? There is no uh, no secret, uh, no special formula. Um, I just knew before I came to India, when I watched his highlights, uh, when I saw he joined the club, I just knew uh, the way his, uh, his play style, uh, the way he plays the game, that we will click. And from the day one, uh, we shook uh, hands. Uh, we started on the training grounds, uh, doing in pairs, uh, different drills get to know each other and it just clicked. That's great. And off the field as well, you have Zuniga as well, you have uh, Hamza as well. And how is your bonding with your teammates, the foreign ones and the Indian ones as well? Uh, I don't have problem uh, with bonding. Uh, the guys took me in, uh, as I said uh, before, as a brother from day one. So it was, this transition was very easy for me. Um, but otherwise, uh, we don't uh, we don't uh, here in the bubble. We stay in the rooms. Uh, we don't mingle a lot. Uh, uh, even in my personal life, uh, I like to stay home, uh, get rest for trainings, uh, focus on the game. So yeah, uh, but when we are in training and games and. Uh, different meals, uh, we have fun, yeah. And could you tell us a little bit more about your experience in Slovenia since you've played there for a long time and come here for the first time? So, how was that like playing in Slovenia? Yeah, uh, I mean, it's, uh, it's a long uh, journey. Uh, I think I've been playing 12 years, 13 years professionally in my country since I was 18. Um, I'm very happy that that I didn't uh, quit before. It was a lot of good times, even bad times, but that's life, that's football. Um, I enjoy, uh, I, I play football, um, I do what I love, uh, but uh, yeah, mm, it was, um, I had few few good teammates uh, throughout my career. For example, I played with na in national team with Jan Oblak, goalkeeper mm. for Atletico Madrid. Then Josip Ilicic plays for Atalanta. Um, 
it's always fun to remember uh, the, this kind of things. But uh, I always wanted to go out of my country and I'm really happy that uh, this finally happened. When I got the call from Churchill Brothers, I said, okay, maybe this is the, the way for me. Uh, and I really didn't hesitate. Uh, I love the opportunity and I'm not, uh, I don't regret, regret it, uh, not even a little. And there are people you've seen who come from foreign countries, they have a little difficult time adapting to the food and the language. So how has that been for you? Um, to tell you the truth, uh, about a month or two before I came here, uh, I have a re uh, Indian restaurant near my place. So I started eating uh, Indian food to get to know it uh, because I know that uh, Indian food, even if it's not spicy, for our taste is a little spicy. So I just wanted to get to know it better. Uh, otherwise, I didn't have problems. Uh, first few weeks, maybe 14 days uh, in Goa was really hot. And I don't mind the uh, sun, but the pitches are uh, more difficult, more uh, hard. And just that uh, was the problem for me personally. But uh, otherwise, I think I adapted very good. Uh, I think as a player, as a professional player, you have to adapt, otherwise you can't play. And once the season is done, you have any plans to roam around or try and do things? Uh, if, if the situation uh, with this, uh, all this uh, will, uh, will allow me, I would like to, to, to roam around Goa, for example, a week or two, uh, maybe after this season to relax a little. Uh, yeah, and then go home. Okay, and this is la coming to the last bit. So, li playing in the bubble, living in the bubble. So, how is that been? How is it? How difficult is it physically and mentally for you? Um, yeah. So, as I said, uh, in my personal life, I like to stay home. Um, so, this is not really so different from my personal life. Uh, I think. If your mind uh, is in the right place now, uh, it's the perfect time for all the players to to get uh, better, to get fit, uh, to be even a better person. You have more time for yourself. Uh, and I think that uh, staying in a five-star hotel where you get everything is, is not really <laughs> bad. Okay, and this last question, the league being organized, of course, in India also everything had come to a standstill, but Football was the first sport that comes. So, what are your thoughts on football coming and the league being organized in one place? Uh, I didn't know uh, what to expect. Uh, so, the first uh, week or two, it was a little shock because we got a uh, schedule, and you had to do uh, and you had to adapt to a schedule, even if you don't usually eat at that time or train at that time. Uh, but we, we all understand this is an uh, unprecedented uh, thing, so I think we're all trying, the organization is trying, uh, really, we have everything that we need. Uh, I think uh, the whole team, the whole staff, uh, the whole management adapted, and I think the table says it all, we adapted uh, the best. Great, Luca, thank you for your time and all the best for the coming games. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you.